this how-to video, we are going to teach you how to break down and clean your HK VP9 semi-automatic handgun. As always, when cleaning your guns, make sure that the magazine is out and that the chamber is clear. Being that the slide is already open, you can now spin the disassembly lever 90 degrees clockwise. Release the slide slowly. Careful here. The slide will want to rocket forward. Make sure you got a good grip and that you let it down with care. Push back on the recoil guide spring and remove it from the slide. At this point, you can take the barrel out as well. This is as far as we'll break down the gun for this basic cleaning. Grab some of our CLP and coat all the metal surfaces as well as the bore. Typically, we'll clean the bore last, allowing the CLP time to soak into the contaminants that are in there. Now is the time to grab some brushes and get to work. A brush is a great place to start with the cleaning as it will break up the majority of the gunk. Get in there and give it a thorough scrubbing. Hit all metal surfaces and take your time here. You don't want to leave behind any debris that could end up resulting in a jam later down the line. If they decide to be stubborn and are holding on for dear life, grab some of our stainless and brass picks to convince them otherwise. Don't worry, we use brass tips on our picks so they won't scratch the metal on your firearms. Another effective way to clean is to take some bristle pipe cleaners and get to the hard to reach areas. What's good about this type of pipe cleaner is that you could bend them in just about any angle that suits your needs. Plus, the stiff plastic bristle will help break apart contaminants while the soft cotton mops it up. Then grab some cotton tipped swabs to help mop up the rest. Make sure you pay attention to the areas where the slide and frame come into contact with one another. Grit left behind in these areas could lead to unnecessary wear and tear on your firearm. Next, go for a 9mm bore cleaning kit for the H&K VP9's bore. Send it through like so, starting at the rear of the barrel and pulling it out through the muzzle. Having let the CLP sit for a little bit should have helped dissolve the carbon. One pull through should do the trick for all but the dirtiest of bores. Give a general wipe down of all surfaces with a rag. Again, you want to make sure there's no dust or particles in there that could end up wearing down your gun. These guns have tight tolerances and you don't want them to get sloppy. Now, you'll want to reapply a coat of CLP on all moving parts to keep them well lubricated. She's cleaned and ready to be reassembled. You can place the barrel back in the slide. This is pretty self-explanatory. There's only one way it's going to go in. Now, you want to take the recoil guide and make sure that the notched end is toward the muzzle. You'll hear a click when it's in. Take the slide and slide it back into the frame. Push it all the way back and lock it open using the slide lock. Flip the disassembly lever 90 degrees counterclockwise. There you have it, a fully cleaned and lubricated H&K VP9. Sage and Breaker, crafted at the highest caliber.